Opening up a Vagabond Kitchen and Tap House um, after Sandy was uh, quite the challenge. Um, you know, we, we suffered uh, uh, two feet of water in the restaurant with about three and a half feet in the kitchen. Uh, we, were, we were out of business for about four months. Very challenging uh, uh, putting this place back together. Uh, there was a lot of work um, on, on our, our behalf, our construction team, to get this place back together and uh, more importantly open, open for the community. Um, you know, open for a large number of reasons. You know, uh, it's being that so many people are still out of their homes, this brings uh, hope, hope to our area. The upgrades to the building are really important. Uh, on the outside, we made some drastic changes to uh, irrigation, to landscaping, bringing some life to the uh, outside of this building. And we planted trees, new shrubs, new bushes, dune grass. Um, and, and new sod, you know, I, I think those are all really important additions. The concept here at Vagabond is uh, good craft beer and high-end comfort food. Uh, we have a great selection of uh, craft beers. Um, we have 12 handles on tap with uh, four rotating uh, handles where we're constantly always changing uh, the variety of uh, craft beers that we have available. Um, some of the local products that we are really trying to push would be uh, Dogfish, uh, their Dogfish line of beers, Dogfish 90, Pablo Santo, uh, Dogfish 60 Minute, and we also have Yards um, from Philadelphia, um, their Pale Ale, and also Yards Brawler, which is a, uh, a heavy seller. Three dishes that I would recommend you definitely have here uh, when you come in to visit us would be the uh, Spicy Californian Burger. Another dish that I would also recommend would be uh, Joe's uh, crab bread, um, jumble lump crab meat over uh, toasted baguettes and a uh, white wine uh, butter sauce. The third one would be the fried uh, goat cheese salad um, served over a spring mix um, with orange zest, candied walnuts, dried cranberries, and a balsamic vinaigrette. Another one of our features here at uh, uh, Vagabond Kitchen and Tap House is our live entertainment uh, every Friday night from 7 to 11. Um, we also are looking forward to featuring uh, craft beer dinners, you know, four course uh, dinners, um, price per person. Uh, we hope to do at least one a month. Our happy hour uh, specials that are going to be running daily, um, two of them actually from uh, four to six and a, a late night happy hour from 11 to close. Some of the things offered in the happy hours would be uh, you know, half price apps you know, across the board. Um, I think we're going to do really well with that.